a 64-96 loss for this Indiana team. It was just nothing could go right for him. Quickly the other way, but rejected by Moore McNeil out of bounds. Sia couldn't get it over the top from the strike, can't get it to go. And Sidney Parrish comes down with the board quickly the other way. Tiscalia, it falls. Great defensive pressure there. They're not giving the Bisons any good looks from the field. The shots the Bisons have put up looked forced, maybe a little bit uncomfortable. Inbound to Holmes, banks it off the glass for two. Moore McNeil will bring it across half court. Swing over to Parrish, she'll try it from deep. You bet! 15 seconds on the shot clock, 34 on the game clock. Moore McNeil inside, swings out, Borgeser, Tiscalia from downtown, yes! Here comes Moore McNeil quickly the other way. Swings out for Parrish from long range. Yes! Holmes calling for it. He'll give it to Scalia. Drops it off once again with the left hand. Just one of their last nine. They haven't scored in over four minutes of game time. Parcher outside for Scalia. Yes! Scalia continues this hot streak from downtown. Now Indiana continuing to extend this lead. Poked away, Scalia the other way. Wide open breakaway layup. It's good, and one. Yeah, the Hoosiers have settled things down a little bit. Margister for Holmes with the left hand, and one. On the inside, Holmes just a workhorse on the baseline. This fight didn't look like there was anybody in the same zip code as Sia right there. Dribble handoff to Garzone, top of the arc, drives inside, spins back, fadeaway, jumper, it falls. Over to Garzone. Looking for Holmes underneath. Too easy. Look to the corner for three. Beaumont gets the roll. It's every single part of the iron. A little bit of a bigger role, even if it is still off the bench. No more knee brace for her this year. She says she feels a lot more comfortable playing out there. Scalia from downtown once again. Now all of a sudden you look up, Lipscomb's on a 6-0 run. Their perimeter shooting, as we were talking about, has finally come alive here in the second half. Garzone tries to respond and does. Now the other way. Borgeser out to Garzone. She'll stop, put it up, rattles in and out. Holmes with the board and the bucket and the foul. Just almost to grab this board, and then she draws the contact as well. I think that was Pearson called for the foul. That's her. Holmes on the inside, loses the handle, goes up through two players, gets the board. Back out, Scalia for three. You bet. Looking for Meister down low, up and in. Drops it off, Lamandola swings outside, Bargesser in the corner, hits back iron. Wisney comes up with it, over to Bargesser, gets Collier in the air, and one! Pump fake well here, gets Collier to leave her feet, goes over the back, a textbook foul, and the finish as well. Parrish coming in a couple years ago, but yeah, this year, Curry Jelks coming over from UT Martin after being named the OVC Freshman of the Year. Lamandola able to get on the board for two.